This is what the marinade looks like for our padded. So from there, what we're gonna do, we're gonna bring over, actually we're gonna preheat our oven to 300 and 350. So now I have some coconut flakes, some breadcrumbs, plain breadcrumbs. I have the um, maple syrup and my egg, right? So now I'm gonna get my um, fish, add it, right? You can see it, it's had it. So, yeah. Um. So, from here, to this, what I'm going to do, I'm going to add the coconut flakes. We're going to add um, less than a, a half less than a quarter of um, coconut flakes, right? We're gonna add our maple syrup. Pour in your maple syrup. I wish I had more maple syrup, but it's okay. So that was um, one tablespoon of maple syrup, right? We're gonna go ahead and we're gonna put in our egg. One egg, crack that in there. We're gonna add our breadcrumbs. We're not gonna add that much. Um, actually, let's do our fish first. Okay. So we're actually gonna kind of grind this um, the haddock up. That's so we can make the patties. So in the same container we made this. In the same container we made the um, the fish marinade. It's the same container we're gonna to use to kind of grind down the fish. And this is actually um, one pound of haddock that I'm using. So I'm gonna wash it off. work on the fish so wash off the fish um, okay get your haddock just slice it up that's so we can put it in the food processor so I'm just slicing them into these into this right there right okay Still a little frozen, sitting in the fridge. I took it out the freezer and put it in the fridge, but whatever. We'll work with what we have. I'm hoping that this will um, this will chop it up, but I don't know. I don't know. I'm just trying to make it work. Okay. Let's see if it works. Turn it on. That's it. Not for too long. We just want to kind of ground up. Okay. 
go ahead and empty it in our mixture. Just cut it up. I just pull it, pull it. Okay. Oh, did it wrong. Okay. So let's go ahead and do that again. Okay, so to this, after we put the haddock, the eggs, the coconut, the um, maple syrup, we're going to add some um, breadcrumbs. Just add a quarter cup of breadcrumbs to this. Not too much. Right, and we're going to fold it in. And if we need more, we'll add more. But better to add um, less and then add more to it. So it just doesn't, you know, you don't overdo anything, right? So, okay, so go ahead and our oven is telling us it's ready. So let's go ahead and just like um, work this in. Okay, I hope you guys can see this Good, right there. Okay, so I'm working it in. We're going to go ahead and we're going to add another quarter cup of um, breadcrumbs because that's not enough. I can tell by looking at it. So we're going to go ahead and we're going to add a little bit more. Okay, and then um, so we're gonna add some Aunt Jemima, um butter syrup because I don't have any more of the pure honey. It's the same thing, right? Pancake syrup or whatever. Just go ahead and we're gonna we're gonna work it out, right? So when you don't have what you need, you improvise. So we're gonna do a half of a um, tablespoon of the maple syrup. Just to kind of give it a little bit of sweetness to it, along with the coconut. And we're going to add a little bit more coconut. So in all, we're going to add a quarter cup of coconut to it, right? Go ahead and blend it in again. Okay. And from here... We are going to, what we're going to do, we're just going to get our pan, our um, dish, pirate's dish, or maybe you want to, um, maybe you want to put the, um, I don't know, maybe you want to use, I don't know, a lined baking sheet or something, whatever you have, just get it, and we're going to start um, 
forming our patties. Okay, so grab the fish and just start forming them into little patty balls. I said balls. Oh, ho, 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 ho. Okay, and not little balls. We're, <laughs> we're doing patties, people. Yeah, so, okay, so there goes one. Let's make another one. So just get it and this is a great lunch idea. Two. They're not gonna be perfect. Nothing in this world is perfect, so no need to make my patties perfect, right? So, okay, grab some more. Do, do, do. Go ahead and whistle or hum your tune as you do your patties. Do, 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 do. You know they're not perfectly dimensioned or whatever you want to call it they're just patties so they don't have to be perfect nothing in this world is so at 350 degrees we're gonna put our fish patties in the oven for about 15 to 20 minutes and then I'll come back to show you what mine look like some sauce and if you guys want to know um, the recipe for my sauce I will actually um, make another video so go ahead and put some of that sauce on just let me know in the comments if you want to know it pairs really good with the food thank you for cooking at this sweet spot enjoy <laughs> <laughs> 